boy, he's okay. Abby treats her horses like they are her kids. We breed these horses, we show them, we sell them. Since May, she says her world-class miniature horses have been under attack. She had been severely brutalized. She had been raped, both by a man and with several objects. She was so hematomed on the back and, and so bloody that she looked like you'd put her whole bottom for a garbage disposal. The vet found bodily fluids inside the horse. Abby says Marion County Sheriff investigators took a report, but they haven't been much help. Now we have been told that we have to catch him in the act. And if we catch him in the act and then call them, they will come and arrest him. But we don't want to die trying to protect our horses. She says they bought a dog to protect the horses, but it was beaten to death as well. So they set up surveillance and a live internet feed. Saturday, the cameras caught him. He walked down this way. He inspected the horses that were on the left first to see what horses were in stalls. After he gets the horse that he wants, he brings them out here. They're tied in the corner to the fence where they have been abused and been tortured. They can't fight with a person. They don't know to fight with a person. They would go with anybody. They are hoping someone will recognize the person in the video, and Abby is sending him a warning. I've never shot a gun in my life, but if I catch this man in this barn taking out another one of my horses, and he's going to traumatize this young horse and hurt her internally like he has my other horses, I will come down and I'll kill him.